everyone! Your favorite penguin is back! Or at least I better be your favorite. How many penguins do you even know? And I'm here to introduce an amazing friend of mine. Can you guess who it is? I'll give you a few hints. I know it's pretty clear from the silhouette, but just play along. It's fun for me. One, a lot of people want this unit. Two, they're so powerful that folks often have two of them. Three, they were recently added to the fusion hexagram. Yep, that's right, it's Melia, the wind dryad, best known for her continuous damage or dots. Melia is fantastic in places like giants within Kairos. Since she's a nat 4, it wasn't always easy to find her, but now that she's available as a fusion, new players can get her pretty quickly. Now, let's take a look at her skills. As I said, Melia is well known for her damage over time, or dots. Continuous damage is a debuff that deals 5% of the enemy's max HP as damage every turn. It ignores defense, which makes it pretty terrifying. And every single one of Melia's attacks will try to put a dot on the opponent, thanks to her passive skill. Leave continuous damage for two turns to the target per turn. And check this out, she leaves an additional dot for two turns when she attacks an enemy target who already has stacks of continuous damage. Every hit she lands will be super impactful. Just keep in mind that a monster can only have up to 10 buffs and debuffs at any given time. Besides her passive skill, her first skill absorbs a single target's attack bar by 15%. Her second skill attacks all enemies, decreasing their attack speed and attack bar. So she controls enemy turns and gnaws away at their health. Despite her cute appearance, she may just be a terrifying monster, which we have in common. <laughs> There's also this famous dot team that folks have invented, and Melia plays an active role in that comp. Why don't we check out how it works in Giants? Let's go! Step 1. Use two Melias since they have no choice but to try and apply at least one dot every turn. Then add a second Awakened Seth, the Fire Grim Reaper, who doubles dot damage. It's symmetrical though, so be careful. But you don't want to just wait around on your enemies to take turns, right? So two-way Tatu, the Fire Pixie, can detonate all stacks of continuous damage at once. The last spot is up to you. Try using Lucian to clear out any remaining enemies. Or for a safer option, you can bring Baramos, the Dark Ifrit, to cleanse debuffs off of your team. Ta-da! The best dot team ever! But for real, don't forget to second awaken Seth and Tatu because that'll upgrade the skills you need to make this work. Visit the Calderone and Elunia dimensions to get that taken care of. I hear they're both lovely this time of year. Also, turn order is really important for this team. Seth and Melia need to move first to land dots, then Tatu turns the continuous damage into something more like instantaneous damage. If it's working right, you should see something like this. Now that was satisfying. If we're looking at stats to focus on, you should make sure to have enough accuracy to land those dots. If Tatu uses her third skill without them, It'll be pretty disappointing, so make sure to pay extra attention to the accuracy and speed. Hold up! I only looked up giants so far. But the same team can actually be used in other PvE areas like Steel Fortress and TOA, so give it a try! I've said this so many times today, but since Melia is all about stacking continuous damage, it's important to consider accuracy sub-properties for runes and artifacts. Oh, but don't let her HP suffer too much. She still needs a bit of that to endure enemy attacks. Adding some speed is always good too, considering you'll need her to keep attacking. For runes, I recommend Will and Shield. Immunity and Shield will help Melia stick around long enough to land at least one more dot. Though, if you're struggling to get the accuracy, try equipping Focus or Accuracy runes. For artifacts, anything with the skill 3 accuracy will be the best option. So what do you think about Melia? She's super cool for the dot team, right? What are you waiting for? If you don't have her yet, go fuse her now. I will be back with another amazing monster next time. Bye!